Okay, there is quite a bit going on here. Um, I think let's open Shepherd Peasant. Probably want to get some hideout witch border guard stuff going on. There isn't great draw here besides Shepherd, so I want to go for Shepherd. Now I probably want another peasant and let's get a border guard. I don't want too many terminals. Uh, this isn't so bad. You're getting a witch here. I'm just going to get a hideout. I'm going to lead on the hideout because I have the card in hand I want to trash anyway. And this helps inform what I'm doing here, which is going to be getting a witch. So now, let's just bring up the third peasant already. So we know that the shepherd is missed already. We are going to have, actually, let's not trigger this shuffle. Um, and let's take another hideout, I think. Which, I don't know. Maybe wasn't the best, but I think we'll be okay anyway. This isn't really what I want to be discipling here, but it will be fine. Stop here and put up an estate, I think, actually. Let's go ahead and take a teacher. Um, I do want to get a lot of shepherds. Three hideouts is kind of a lot. Probably will end up going for Bandit at some point. Let's grab another Shepherd now. Okay, so we're going to Fugitive first here. Dis discarding a Copper is perfectly fine. Okay. We get our teacher down. I think we're going to want to stick. Okay, disciple. Let's stick plus card on border guard, I guess. Just because of what our hand looks like. keep thinning here. Now I'm gonna need some more econ. Let's get another peasant so we can take a thing and I actually am thinking about buying copper but let's not. Definitely want to keep and definitely want to exchange. Okay this should be fine I want to afford Bandit here, is my goal for the turn. I should be able to accomplish that. I'm going to probably trash a hideout this turn. I'm going to Disciple Border Guard here. Grab the draw card, the horn of course. Okay, we'll do Witch next. So let's just do this. Uh, so 
soldier makes three. I could trash this copper and play the peasant. I don't think it's going to matter too much. But I think I'd rather keep the copper around. I guess it really, really doesn't matter. Keep, keep, and top deck. The, the soldier is just going to be my money for quite a while, so that's what's up with that. The bandit, I mean, hitting your Hitting your, your pasture would be a big game, but also I think it's a way to get money. Oh, I'm also going to want... Okay, so let's stick coin... No, let's stick buy on shepherds. Okay. Play a disciple, trash... I guess the witch. Because I don't want to trash either of these other things. Just disciple a bandit. Play this. Grab the last border guards. Uh, let's exchange this now. Now that I have these golds, it's less of a less of an important issue. Um, plus buy on shepherd is. I do have to watch for piles running. My deck just seems much, much better than yours somehow. Not exactly sure when that happened. I guess your travelers have been caught up behind for quite a bit. Three border guards here I should be should be fine, I think. Um let's discard the estate. It's not a particularly fun thing to do, okay, but I think it's fine. Take the pasture for now, and the curse for now, and the estate for now. Trash the curse, and take this estate. Discard these into this shuffle. Okay. So if I disciple shepherd, that gives me extra buys. If I disciple peasants, that gives me extra buys and money. It gives me more extra buys, right? Uh, three, four. Peasant is five, so it's just about having enough money. I have like ten. If I disciple peasant, I could have ten, but that's not enough. So I don't think I'm winning this turn. So therefore, oh, maybe I've miscounted a bit. So this is six buys right now. This could be seven. I mean, there's plenty of buys. This is 12, 13, 14. This is enough to win, I believe. Yeah. Keep, keep, keep. Um, yeah, the teacher seems pretty good to me here. I guess you just didn't get going, and then you didn't get the curses trashed somehow. I'm not exactly sure what went wrong for you, because 
don't particularly remember any decisions that seem particularly bad. Um, but I have obviously, once I got the border guard going and the teacher token on it and all of that stuff, things really started rolling for me. Um, my guess is you just had some bad shepherd draws probably and maybe some terminal collision stuff missing the shuffle. And that probably put you very far behind. Probably if I was watching from your side, it would be very frustrating because it didn't seem, like I say, it didn't seem like any of the decisions that my opponent made were particularly bad from, from what I was seeing. Things just worked out really well for me. Yeah, thanks for watching.